I would not force it on, upon my child. I would say to them at an age that I felt was appropriate, like, hey, there's this really cool sci-fi movie that your your dad and I like. I think um, well, Luke. The, and, I don't, um, I don't <laughs> you think, might want to watch I it. I don't think at any point, if we ever had children, anyone's going to look at us and be like, when did your children start learning you you like Star Wars? Like, no. oh, maybe it's from all the posters, Star Wars memorabilia, the fact they're named Admiral. I mean, I, there's a lot know, of stuff going on. But I think uh, I would not force Star Wars upon so, my child. I would, you know, let them know of it and, you know, what introduce it, it to them. And if they didn't like it, then we would be having a garage sale and our child would just happen to be for sale. Oh, thank God, because I really thought you were in a garage. I like my eyes started widening up, like, we're not getting rid of some of our Star Wars stuff. No, oh, no, we would have a garage sale and there would be a child for sale. No, I mean, I'd it sell, would be I'd heartbreaking. But I would, I would, I would, if as long as one of our children, like, if we had one <sighs> child and that child ended up not liking Star Wars, we'd have to get another child. There's so many reasons people have multiple kids. <laughs> so case, Ours would be like, you well, don't like Star Wars? Tommy, get to bed, we're doing it again. <laughs> Just in case one of them doesn't like Star Wars. 